In this module, I will demonstrate how to set up the configuration and use the sample code from Advantic to establish a private server. WISE 4000 series supports a lot of kind of IoT cloud services, including public cloud and private cloud. For the private one, WISE provides the interface to set up private server configuration and that WISE module to upload and push data to the cloud with different data formats accordingly. Therefore, in this chapter, I will introduce what is the topology and advantage of private server. Moreover, how to use private server interface and the sample code to establish one will depend on the real application. In the beginning, I will introduce the meaning of private server and what is the scenario the customer wants to use it. Next, I will show you how to use our sample code to make the private server at local computer and also net.js sample code at the local computer with Windows and Linux. At last, we have a video to show how to demonstrate this function. Private server is an application established on a per personal computer and collects data from other network devices. There are two benefits for the private server. First, because data is saved in local computer, user, user can easily apply those data to, to the further application for the monitoring purpose, such as charts and database. Second, we provide the sample code for private server. User do not need to spend extra money to rent a cloud storage service, such as Dropbox or Alivin or Azure. In summary, this solution can make user easily manage data, save some money, and keep the data in private with security purpose. It is very easy to be impl in implemented by WISE module and the private server sample code we, we provided. The user just set the private server configuration in WISE module and open the and launch the private server sample code in the target computer. WISE will upload or push the data to it. WISE can push two kinds of data to the private server, real-time and historical data. The real-time data is JSON format, and historical data is CSV format. The next slide will, sh will show you about the difference of these two functions. WISE is very flexible for different applications. It can upload or push data to private or public cloud services. As shown on this figure, WISE can send CSV file to the FTP server or go to database through ODBC interface. Also, it can send data through MQTT or webhook to third-party MQTT broker or third-party media platform like LINE, Twitter, WeChat, or email, and so on. There is a manual for private server sample code under the very same folder with the code. This menu shows how to implement TLS SSL connection and some troubleshooting instructions. The default private server port number is configurable in the sample code. Like the comparison table on the slide in the slide, the default setting of private server without using TLS SSL security connection is using ports 8000. And it is using ports 8080 for default one if using TLS security connection. More information and comparison port number of different private or public cloud services can be found in FAQ on support portal or ATEM forum. Before upload data to the private server, there are several settings to be done first. Please go to the private server configuration page. Current status 
is the debug message to let a user to know the connection status between a private server and WISE module. The user can also see the error code to, to do some diagnostic. Here is several settings to make connection. Server IP or using domain name of the server port and the server ports of the private server. WISE also can support SSL security protocol. Once SSL security has been enabled, he needs to set up the SSL se service on your private server. For SSL security, you can have authentication for the private server with a username and password, which is also private provided by our sample agent. There is a document to teach you how to set up the SSL server by our sample code. This page will show you the setting about uploading historical data and real-time data. There are three options in the local configuration page. Memory storage, cloud upload, and push notification. Memory storage is applied to log data in the local memory of WISE module. Cloud upload is applied to upload a patch of historical data in CSV data format from the local memory to the cloud server. Thus, you must open memory storage before enable cloud upload function. It can be used for private server, Dropbox, or Azure IoT Hub, for example. Push notification is applied to upload real-time data in, in JSON format to the, same, to the private server by periodical time. This function can be used in private server, Azure IoT Hub, or iSensing MQTT. The upload and push function of WISE module have different action after a data transmitted field. There is a flag in firmware recording which data has been uploaded successfully. The data after upload failure will be transmission three times. If upload failure after three times, the package will be repacked and integrated into the next period data log. Push function is different. A data after upload failure will be tr retransmitted three times. The push, if again failure, the data package will be discarded. In the previous slides, I have mentioned that Adventec provides two kind of private server sample code. Where can we get them? They are included in Adden Apex .NET class library. You can find the, find the link on the support portal. Moreover, the step-by-step -step document is also included. A user can follow the documents to establish his own private server in private network and implement SSL security. Adventech provides two kinds of sample code, c and Node.js. C# -sharp is a .NET based program which is executed program running at Windows OS. Node.js is a web based program which can run on any kind of OS such as Linux. Besides, private server also provides HTTPS for security communication. In the following slides we will show you how to set up how to establish private server with these both sample codes when you are launching this program this sample code the private server is establishing at the same time the upper window shows the files private server received the lower window shows the contents of each file you can monitor the upload situation from this program and the file will be storage under the very same folder.
As shown on this figure, the uploaded CSV file is under the same folder as we mentioned before, and the data will create a folder named after the module, uh, the model name of the WISE module, and following with the MAC address of it. The received data is shown on this file. The value of key PE indicates the periodic data log or event. The event mode is shown on the table on the right side. The value of key TIM indicates timestamp when the data is logged. Suggest that use GMT format is easier to read the logged data. The value of key UID indicates the UUID of the module that user set in information configuration. The value of key M MSC indicates the MAC ID address of the module. The value of key record indicates the analog input, digital input, or digital output data at the login time. Pushed data is not as easy to understand as uploaded data. The information in array is as follows. Slots indexed for the very first one. Channel indexed for the second one. And it's IO type index and IO value. If you need more detailed information about these messages, you can check the AFAQ on Aiden Foran. There are several steps to establish a sample code of Node.js program. First, the following document step by step to generate two files, key and server.certification. Copy them and pass into the folder where sample code is located. Second, open a node.js command by administrator and get into folder where the sample code is located. Third, enter node app.js to enable the private server. Then you can see the command thread keep receiving files from WISE module. If you need document, it will be under the sample code folder. There is a private server user menu for detailed step by step. Or the following, or this video will show you how to do it.
Thanks for your listening. Have a nice day.